I hope I'll get a nice hairstyle. Two ponytails? If I accept, all my friends are going to make fun of me because I look like a little girl. It's okay, honey. It's a trend now. No, mom, it's not. I'm going to refuse it. Look how pretty my hair is. Yeah, it looks really good. I wish I got that hairstyle. Where is your hairstyle? You didn't get one? I did, but I rejected it. You should pick a unique one so your soulmate can find you. Yeah, I'm going to accept the next choice I get. I chose a half up, half down ponytail. I chose a bun. You guys are lucky. Don't worry, just keep refusing until you get a good one. Yeah, I did that as well and it worked. Wow, then I have a better chance of getting a good hairstyle. I hope this time they'll give me a good hairstyle, which is better than my friends. Huh? Bold hairstyle? That means I'm not going to have any hair. Why would they even give me this choice? It's okay, honey. Just accept it. Your hair will grow healthier. I don't want to, mom. You should be thankful and stop I'm being I'm not picky. being picky. I'm going to refuse it. I'm worried about you. You haven't picked a hairstyle yet. You have to quickly pick one so you can marry your soulmate. Calm down. I still have time. Hopefully, they'll give me a hairstyle this time that I like because I'm so tired of this. Huh? A bob cut? Not happening. I'm not cutting my hair. Sis, there's an old man staring at you. You have to pick a hairstyle quickly so you can get married and no one will stare at you anymore. No, I'm refusing it. I can't believe I still haven't gotten the hairstyle I want. I heard that if you get two braids, you're a special person. What do you mean a special person? You'll get treated like a queen with that hairstyle. Gosh, you still haven't picked? How many times have you refused? Three times. But you only get three chances. Now you'll never meet your soulmate. Calm down. Special people get to choose four times, and I'm sure I'm going to get to choose again. But you're not special. Yes, I am. Just watch. They'll give me another choice. I really hope so. I'm starting to get a bit worried. What if they don't give me another choice? Yes, I knew it. They're giving me another choice. Okay, hopefully this time they'll give me braids. Huh? Two braids? I managed to get the special hair! Don't accept it because... It's okay. This hairstyle is profitable. I don't want to waste this opportunity, so I'm going to accept it. Make a soulmate or find a soulmate? I think it's better to make a soulmate. Wait! Do not press to make a soulmate because three days ago my friend chose to make a soulmate and the result was really bad. Bad? How? Just imagine, her soulmate is not fully human. He's half human, half cow. He looks really but scary. But I chose to make a soulmate. What do I do now? Yeah, well then, there's no hope anymore. Four legs or two legs? He'd look scary with four legs. This was a weird question anyway. I told you, they're going to keep giving you strange options. If the other question is safe, it doesn't matter to me. It was your friend's fault for choosing the strange one. True, I mean, she was obsessed with cows, so... Eat rice or eat grass? What do they think my soulmate is? A goat to be eating grass? It's getting so weird. Yeah, but thank God they're still giving me safe options. That way I don't have to pick the crazy ones. Hey, you two, what did I just say to the whole class? Um, we were talking about the history of... History? This is a biology lesson. Both of you, get out of my class. Sorry I got us kicked out. It's okay, don't worry about it. I just got another choice. It says to choose for my soulmate to have a nose or fins. If I make the wrong choice, my soulmate could be half human, half fish. You mean like a mermaid? That's so cool. No, you're crazy if you think I'll ever marry a mermaid. Let's try that ice cream over there. I'm full, to be honest. I just got another choice. It's between rich or short. Choose rich. Money matters more than height. I mean, you're right. Amara, come have ice cream. I already told you, I don't want ice cream. And also, I'm allergic to milk. Wait, my soulmate will appear in one hour? Okay, I have to go home. Wait, don't you want to stay with me while I'm ordering the ice cream? No, I have to go. Bye. Mom, my soulmate will appear in five minutes. Amazing, I can't wait to meet him. I wonder what he looks like. Okay, my soulmate will appear in three, two, one. That must be him. I can see someone's last drink or last meal. I think their last meal is more interesting. Mom, I'm going to eat quickly before going to school. Oh my gosh, you ate a cockroach? Yeah, I wanted to try it. I learned how to fry it online. Do you want to try some? No, thank you. I'm going to school. Bye. Wait, before you go, here, take a couple with you so you can eat them at lunch. Whatever, Mom. Thanks. 
It turns out all my friends are healthy because they eat vegetables all the time. Amara, what's that in your lunchbox? What kind of food is that? It looks delicious. The fried cockroaches. Do you want to try some? Sure, I've never had them before. I heard they're really good. Thank you for sharing your lunch. You're usually very stingy. I feel bad for you because you eat vegetables all the time. How do you know that I eat vegetables? Because I can see people's last meal. If that's true, can you check my last meal? Chicken liver? Gosh, you're right. But please don't tell anyone I have this power. I feel like everyone who ate your cockroach yesterday is gone. Huh? Gone? How? They didn't come to school today. Who made that cockroach? My mom, but it's impossible that she would poison my lunch. The teacher now suspects you. Luckily, I didn't try your lunch yesterday, so I'm saved. You wanted to see me, sir? Aria said you can see someone's last meal, right? But I told her not to tell anyone. Is that true, Amara? Yes, sir. Meet me at the school warehouse at 3 this afternoon. I wonder why he wants me to meet him at that exact time. Okay, sir. Why does it smell so rotten in here? You should see their last meal. Huh? Them? That's my friends who didn't show up to school today. Why do they look so pale? Everyone who ate your cockroach died. One of them, as you know, is the president's daughter. There's no way. I guarantee you my lunch wasn't poisoned. I need you to please look at their last meal. Huh? Why can't I see it? The last meal isn't appearing, sir. Okay, I'll give you three hours. If you can't prove it, you'll be found guilty and will be punished. Buy these glasses, please. They're cheap. No, thanks. I don't want to buy any glasses. But they have a great power. You won't regret it. Great power? Okay, who knows? Maybe they can help me. I'll take them. You're here, which means you can see people's last meals, right? I'll try, sir. This is your last chance. Okay, I'll put on these glasses first. So, what's the last meal? What vote is that, Dad? Today, everyone will vote for you, depending on if they think you're beautiful or ugly. If everyone considers you ugly, you'll be killed. Don't worry, I'll help you with your first vote. Mom, you're gonna vote beautiful, right? I'm not your mom, I'm your stepmother, and no, I'm not gonna vote that. Because your face reminds me of your mom, and she was ugly. Lucy, if you vote beautiful for me, I'll do the same for you. <laughs> you really think I'm gonna vote beautiful? I'm voting ugly. I want you to die so that I can take your boyfriend. Grandma, help me. I don't want to die. Everyone's voting ugly. Okay, honey, be patient. Sometimes life is unfair, even though we do good for others. But don't worry, I'll vote beautiful, okay? Thank you, Grandma. Guys, whoever votes ugly for Amara, I'll give them a hundred pounds. Wow, okay. I voted. Give me the money. Why are you doing this to me? Why are people mean to me when I'm always nice to them? I'm going to start being mean too. Amara, don't be mean. It's not all about how you look on the outside. The inside counts too, and you have a very good heart, so I'm voting beautiful. Besides, yesterday, someone told me that you helped some orphans. Thank you very much. Hey, babe, since I'm your girlfriend, can you vote beautiful for me? No, I'm bored of you. If you die, that means I can have a new girlfriend. A new girlfriend? Yes, I've been wanting to break up with you for the longest time. My dad was right. I should have listened to him and left that guy a long time ago. This is my last chance. Sis, please vote beautiful for me. You don't want to lose me, do you? Actually, if you disappear, dad will love me more, so I'm voting ugly. No! What did you just do? Bye, sis. Huh? Dad, can you buy me makeup to cover up my birthmark? Makeup? I don't even know about these things. And anyway, you're too young. Are you being bullied at school because of your birthmark? No. Who made fun of your birthmark? Two girls in my class. Their names are Gemma and Sarah. Is that so? They're just jealous of you, honey, because you were born different. Jealous of me? Okay, thanks, Dad. Kids, for some reason, Sarah and Gemma has been transferred to another school. But before they leave, let's all say bye to them first. Bye, Sarah. Bye, Gemma. This is all your fault, Amara. We hate you. Dad, I'm going to school alone today. Please don't follow me. I'm so proud of you, honey. You're all grown up now. Thanks, Dad. Okay, I'm gonna leave now. Bye! Why are you wearing a mask, Amara? Because... Take it off, otherwise I'll make all the girls at school make fun of you. Anyway, we all know about your bath mark. You're so ugly, I'm gonna send a picture of you to the class group chat. Did you see the picture Emma sent of Amara? Yeah, that bath mark makes her look like a clown, and her parents must be so ashamed of her. 
Hey, you two, don't speak to her like that. Do you want what happened to Sarah and Jama to happen to you? They only got kicked out of school because Amara told her dad and snitched on them. Who tells you she can't snitch on you too? Just be careful with how you speak to her. Hey, Amara, come here. What is it? Sorry, I was just bored and your face annoys me. Hey, what's wrong with you punching Amara's face like that? Shut up, you might be handsome, but you're really stupid to be friends with that weirdo. Well, at least being handsome is better than being ugly and crazy. I'm gonna report you- Please, no, just don't get involved. Amara, your eye is bruised. What if your dad sees you and finds out you're still being bullied at school? He won't find out. Trust me, you know your dad. He's really rich and very strict. Yes, but he's only rich because he's a mafia boss. What? A mafia boss? Yes, that's why I have to hide this bruise. Because if he finds out, whoever punched me won't be alive anymore. Don't even try hiding that bruise. Tell me who punched you, now. Intelligence potion or rich potion? I'll choose intelligence. I know everyone will pick this one. Bye, mom. I'm going to school. I don't even know why I'm paying for your school. You're just dumb. I'm literally throwing my money away. It must suck to be stupid and poor, right? Yeah. This one has a complete package of bad things. Klaus, we have a test today. Amara, are you prepared to get the lowest grade again? <laughs> Let's see. You have five minutes left. I'm done. Here, sir. I'm sure my grade will be the highest. Congrats, Amara. You've got the highest grade. You've improved a lot. Seriously, sir? Yes. Congratulations. That's impossible. She cheated. I was watching the whole time. There's no way she cheated. Then let's do another test to see if she gets high grades again. Okay. Tomorrow we'll do another test. Let's make a deal. If I get the highest grade, you'll leave the school. And if you get the highest grade, I'll leave. Okay. That sounds like a good deal. Look, she thinks she can beat Sophia. Poor thing. She has no chance. Here's your test. You have one hour. A whole hour? It will be a piece of cake for me. Sir, I'm done. Me too, sir. I know I'm gonna win. Don't be so convinced. I need to check first. So, sir, who got the highest grade? Okay, so the student with the highest grade is... It will rain every time I sleep or every time I eat. Sleep, of course, because usually it's good to sleep while it rains. Mom, can you take me to school? I can't take you because I have work to do. But I'm going to be late. That's not my problem. This is the right time to try out my strength. Wait, what? How comes it's suddenly raining so much? Okay, fine. I'll take you to school. Hey, Emily. Why do you look so sad? Jake, he's dating Stephanie. And what's wrong with that? We were childhood friends. I thought one day me and him... Come on, stop crying. You should never cry for a boy. I'm not going to maths class later. Yeah, as always, you skip maths to go play basketball. No, this time I have permission. I'm going to Germany for a basketball game. Just pray it doesn't rain. Don't worry, it won't rain. I'm not sleepy. What do you mean, babe? Um, nothing. Have a safe flight. <gasps> Why do I feel so sleepy? Why is it raining? Amara, wake up! What's wrong? You scared me. How come the rain stopped immediately? Try sleeping again. Gosh, you can control the rain. Yes, it rains every time I sleep. Whoa, so cool. Have you done the homework? Huh? What homework? Sir said anyone who hasn't done the homework is getting a detention. I'll just sleep. Sir called the principal and said he's not coming in for the next lesson because it's raining. But what about the homework? I know you slept so that sir wouldn't check our homework. Yeah, so what? I know your boyfriend would be really angry with you because you made it rain. Oh yeah, I forgot he had a flight to Germany today. Honey, remember, Justin has a flight today. Don't sleep so it doesn't rain. Wait, what did mom just say? What's my future salary? 50 million? That's a lot. I better put it on private so that my friends don't use me. How much is your salary, honey? 20 pounds. 20 pounds? That's so little. What a shame. I'm paying so much for your school for no reason. It's not for no reason. I'm still learning. I don't want to pay your school fees anymore. Hey, Em, um, what are you doing? Hey, I'm planning what house I'm buying in the future because my salary is 200,000. Whoa, that's a lot. How much is your salary, Amara? Why um, is it on private? 20 pounds. Huh? That's so little. I knew I was much smarter than you. Hey, don't be arrogant. Hi guys, what's your salaries? Mine's 40,000. Mine's 12,000. 
Mine's a hundred and ten thousand. What about yours? Twenty pounds. Huh? Seriously? You might as well just quit school then. Yeah, you're just wasting your time. Why are you guys so rude? Class, please choose a group you want to work with on the new project. Okay, sir. Hi, guys. Can I join your group? You're really asking that? Of course not. Those whose salary is below ten thousand can't join our group. But you don't know how much my salary is. It's on private. Amara, come on. Everyone in school knows that your salary is twenty pounds. Just buy candy with it or something. That's if you can afford it. So why does it say that I got grade C on my paper? It should say B on here. I heard your future salary is twenty pounds, but how come your grades are so good? I don't know, but can you change it back to B? Sorry, I can't, Amara. Everyone's gonna think that I've given you a fake grade. Everyone's so mean. I wonder what they will say once they find out my future salary is much higher than theirs. Amara, please take off your mask. Okay, sir. I'm so dead. Whoa, your lips are so red. This means your soulmate's perfect. I'm proud to have a student like you in my class. Thank God he didn't find out I faked my lip color. Thank you so much. You saved me from getting caught by the teacher, and now I finally have a lip color. Of course, we always help each other out, right? Yeah, but. How come you never show your lip color to anyone? Um, I'm a bit hungry. Do you want to get food from the cafeteria? Why is she changing the subject? Amara, I bought you a drink. Please come on a date with me. I'll take you to a restaurant. Hey, I bought you a teddy bear. Wait, wait. Why are all the boys being so nice to me? It's because of your lip color. They all want to be your soulmate because your soulmate's perfect. I can't believe so many people have a crush on me. Actually, I still don't believe your lip color is original. What else do I have to do to prove it, sir? Try wiping your lips with this tissue. Why is it so wet and smelly? Just do it. Okay. See, nothing came off. I told you I didn't fake it. This means your lips are real. I'm amazed. Don't you feel there's something strange about the teacher's behavior? No. Why are you so suspicious of him? He's just acting weird. Don't worry. I'm sure it's nothing. Anyway, I'm gonna go look for my soulmate. Bye. Amara, wait! Your lips, they changed color. What? Oh gosh, why are they black? I don't think you should meet your soulmate. Why not? You'll be in danger, because... Huh? I have to make five people become friends? What is this, mom? Yes, if you make five people become friends, a whole family will be rich and famous. <gasps> That's my dream ever since childhood. So what are you waiting for? Come on quickly, accept the challenge. Okay. I have to make my mom my friend. Mom! Are you looking for me? What do you need? Mom, I have to make you my friend in order to complete this challenge. Okay, if that's the case, I'll be your friend now. I didn't expect it to be this easy. Okay, who's the second person? Her? Huh? But Ava's my enemy. How am I going to be friends with her? Did you just say my name? Do you want to be friends with me? But I swear we've hated each other since childhood. You must have bad intentions. No, I don't. I promise. Okay, I'll be your friend, but I have some conditions. What are your conditions? You have to pay for my school lunch for the whole year. And if you don't, I won't be your friend. If I don't pay for her lunch, I won't get the reward. So I have no other choice. Yes, fine. I'll pay for your lunch. Here's for today's. Okay, we're finally friends. Charlotte, do you want to be my friend? Um, yeah, sure. You seem like you're kind. I don't see why not. How come it's this easy? Okay, who's next? Teacher? But my teacher's really messed up. How could I be friends with her? What's wrong, Amara? Do you want to be my friend? I'll be your friend, but only if you clean up this whole class in three minutes. Three minutes? Okay. Done. Wow, that was quick. Well done. We're friends. Yay! Thank you so much, miss. Okay, one more person. I wonder who it could be. Dad? But I haven't seen my dad ever since I was little. I have to ask my mom for help. Mom, I wanted to ask you about my biological father. How many times have I told you not to speak about him? But mom, in order for us to be rich and famous, I have to be friends with him. He's the last one. Okay, in that case, come with me. Yes, I can finally meet my dad. Thanks, mom. But remember, no hugs, okay? Okay. Um, uh, mom, where's that? He's right there, honey. Switch bodies with sister or soulmate? My sister rarely takes showers anymore, so I'm gonna pick soulmate. Whoa, this is my soulmate's body? She's so beautiful. 
Amara, go to the principal's office now. Her name is Amara. Look, the nerd is here. Are you talking about me? Yeah, you have a problem. Tell us now. Why are they like this? Hey, do my homework. Why are you giving it to me? Did you forget our agreement? Her agreement? If you don't want to do my homework, I'm going to tell my dad to remove you from the school. I'm not going to do it. So all this time my soul has been treated like this? Why don't you want to do my homework? Because I just don't. You'll regret that. Wow, Amara's brave now. Are you the one who tore Sarah's uniform? What? No. Yeah, she did, miss. She tore my uniform. <sighs> Stop lying. You're only angry because I didn't do your homework. Amara, I believe Sarah. You ripped her uniform. No, I didn't. Why are you speaking to me like that? I'm your teacher. Why are you treating your students so badly? You're believing her over me. You're brave. Now, I'm going to teach you a lesson. What are you going to do? Amara, there's a handsome guy looking for you. He's at the canteen. Mom, what choices did I get? Your choice is to take off your ponytails or your lipstick. Okay, I'll remove my lipstick. You can't. Bad things will happen if you remove it. Okay, Mom. Look, the blind girl. Yeah, that lipstick looks so ugly on her. Are you guys not tired of bullying me? Hey, the blind girl has the courage to answer now. <laughs> Class, we will hold a poetry reading competition. I want to join. You're blind. How are you going to read? Sir, don't let her. Amara, from now on, you don't have to join reading class. It's useless. Yeah, you. but... Actually, we're ashamed to have people like you in our class. Why do I have to be blind? Why can't I be the same as the other kids? Hello, excuse me. I'm new here. I wanted to ask where the library is. In, uh... Uh, sorry, you can't see, right? Yes, I'm blind. Oh, okay. I'm Ryan, by the way. I'm Amara. Look, the blind girl's here. Let's bully her. Hey, red lip, confused, right? Where Give it back, back, please. Here, take it. You're stupid anyway. Guys, stop bullying her. Who the hell are you? Why are you getting involved? Actually, he's handsome. Why don't you introduce yourself? I don't want to be friends with mean girls like you. You're so arrogant. Let's just go. Thanks, Ryan, for helping. Welcome, Amara. I'm your friend after all. Wow, I finally have a friend. You don't have any friends at school? No, they all think I'm weird because I'm wearing red lipstick. They call me red lip. Why are you wearing it anyway? You're beautiful without it. Just remove it. Mom says bad things will happen if I do. I feel like there's something weird about that lipstick, don't you? Maybe that's why you're blind. No way. I've been blind since childhood, Ryan. But you've also worn that lipstick since childhood. Oh. You're right. Just remove it. Don't be scared. Okay, I'll remove it now. I can know my boyfriend's friend's name or what people have me saved us on the phone. Of course, I'm going to choose contact name. Morning, Mom. Morning, honey. Mom, how come you've saved my name as least favorite child? No, honey, that was your sister. She took my phone and changed your name. I don't know how to change it back. Hey, Jess. Hey, bestie. I miss you so much. Two-faced? Seriously? How did you know? Did you hack my phone? No, I have the power to see what people save me as. I can't believe you saved me as two-faced. Hey, Amara, you can read the contact names, right? Please, can you check what my boyfriend saved me as? Okay. Girlfriend number three. Not possible. There must be an error in the system. Hey, Amara, why are you in a bad mood? Nothing. I'm just getting annoyed with people. Why are you annoyed? You're the same. Hey, nerd, why are you always walking alone? You don't have any friends, do you? When will you stop bullying me? Never. By the way, what did you say my name as on your phone? I saved your name as the loner. Are you sure? Purple village or yellow village? Which one do you think I should choose? Just choose the purple village, honey, because you don't have any friends, and there you can make friends. Okay, I'll choose the purple village. Look at Amara, she's always alone. Yeah, she doesn't have a dad. Continue bullying me, I don't care. You don't care? Yeah, because soon I'll have new friends at the purple village. Did you just say purple village? Oh my gosh, she chose the purple village. Why did they all look surprised? I just heard from the other kids that you chose the purple village, right? Yes. Cool, I chose the purple village too. Finally, I found someone else who chose the purple village too. 
Did anyone else choose the purple village besides us? No, just us. We stand alone. Okay, good. Guys, I know you all don't like me, but can you please just answer one question? Okay, what do you want? Why did you all choose the yellow village? Why didn't you choose the purple village? Because there's a mystery behind the purple village. Huh? There's a mystery? Yeah, apparently it's dangerous to go there. But that's not what mum told me. That's weird. My mum didn't tell me it was dangerous. She said I'd have new friends. Okay, I'm about to go see for myself. Three, two, one. Huh? I'm already at the purple village. Welcome to the purple village. Hi, everyone. Here, you'll have a lot of friends. So nice to meet you. Welcome. Finally, I have new friends here. What was your old village like? Everyone bullied me. Why? Because I don't have a dad. Don't worry. Here, no one will bully you. In fact, bullying is forbidden. I don't think anyone else chose the purple village besides you. I have a friend named Kelly. She also chose the purple village. But where is she? She hasn't come yet. True. I wonder why she's not here yet. <gasps> that must be her. I'm going to tell her to come over. Hey, finally you arrived. There's so many people you have to meet. Come on. Sorry, Amara. I didn't come here to live in this village. Huh? You didn't come to live here? Then what are you doing here? I came here to pick you up. Listen, you need to know that the people in this village are actually... That's enough. I've tested them all now. It's time for me to show my real status. Why does it say error? Is there an error in the system? Guys, you won't believe it. I got the status queen of school. What? No, I have the status queen of school. You don't have to lie, Amara. Yeah, just tell us your real status. Guys, I'm the original school queen, not Emily. What the heck? You're just jealous of me. Where's the proof that you're the queen of school anyway? My status still says error, but just trust me, I'm not lying. No, we don't trust you. You told me you were a gardener yesterday. That's why I broke up with you. See, clearly I'm the queen of school. I've already asked the principal to kick you out. No, you can't do that. Of course I can, and you'll see soon. Hey, you have to pack your things. You're expelled from school. <sighs> Sir, you can't do that. I'm the queen of school. Emily is the queen of school, and I trust her more. You don't even have proof. But, sir. Sir, give her a chance to prove her status. Okay, because you're the king of school, I have to accept your request. Jake, thanks for helping me earlier. You're welcome. I hope you're not lying to me about your status. Of course not. Hey, gardener, don't come near Jake. He's my soulmate. You can't ban her from talking to me. I'm waiting for her error to go away so she can show her real status. But I am the queen of school. I'm literally the prettiest girl here. Well, one of you are lying, and whoever it is will get a harsh punishment. How do I fix the system? Ouch, my leg is injured. What happened? I fell while sweeping the floor. Okay, wait right here. I'll be right back. Oh, look, the gardener's trying to help the cleaning lady. <laughs> Here's some medicine. Thank you, you're very kind. <gasps> my status, it doesn't say error anymore. Hopefully I'll get a red heart. Mom, I got a green heart. That means your soulmate already has another girl and they love each other. They love each other? Just fake the color of your heart so no one knows. And remember, never tell anyone you got green. Okay, I think this looks real, right? I don't think anyone will notice. Hey Jake, you're cheating on me, admit it. What are you talking about? Both our hearts are red. I know you're cheating, I have proof. Where? Show me. But mom said I can't reveal the green heart. See, you're just trying to accuse me. Yeah, you're right. Morning, everyone. What's the color of your heart? We all got red, meaning our soulmates aren't cheating on us. So, I'm the only one who got green? Amara, you have to help me. I got a green heart. Wait, why are you so worried? People say if you get a green heart, you'll get kicked out of the school. That can't be true. Just calm down. Okay, I trust you. But what's your color? <laughs> what do you mean? It's red. It looks weird. There's a different shade of red than the others. I have to get out of here before she finds out. Hey, uh, see you in class, okay? Whoever got green, come to the front. Hurry up, otherwise I'm gonna have to check myself. Sir, she has a green heart. What the heck, Amara? Sir, what did you just do? Whoever has a green heart has to die. Why would you snitch on Sarah? I don't know, I panicked and I didn't know he would kill her. He did it because the green color is considered to interfere with the happiness of the soulmate. Can we stop talking about this? We're safe. I can't help but feeling guilty. 
Mom, I'm home. Why do you look sad? Is it because of the Sarah incident at school? Huh? How come you know? I haven't told you yet. I heard from your friends. Anyway, it's not your fault. But remember, keep your green heart hidden. Yes, Mom, but until when? You have to hide it forever. It's weird. Amara has a red heart, but she still hasn't met her soulmate. You didn't fake your color, did you? Me? No. It would be really bad if you did. I know. I would never. Guys, don't listen to her. She's lying. She definitely faked it. Show us now. Yes, show us your mark. Gosh, Amara, the color of your heart has changed to black. Black? What does a black heart mean? A black heart means...